After years of watching him on television, winning his record 17 Grand Slams, tennis fans in India will now be able to watch Roger Federer live. The tennis legend has joined Mahesh Bhupati's IPTL and will be playing for the Indian team, India Aces. Federer replaces Rafael Nadal, his arch, uh, arch nemesis in the Indian team, after the Spaniard withdrew, citing injury concerns. Federer had earlier refused to be a part of this event, despite the other three of the top four, Nadal, Novak Djokovic and Andy Murray, all agreeing to participate in the league. I'm really looking forward to making my first trip to New Delhi. Thank you to my friends, India, Aces, Kobe, and I'll have to go to New Delhi. Bye. Pete Sampras, Roger Federer, perhaps two of modern tennis's greats, two men who've been compared to each other a lot, and of course, Pete Sampras being the man whose record Roger Federer broke to become perhaps the greatest of all time. And now both of these gentlemen will be representing the same team in Mahesh Bhupati's IPTL, and the cherry on the cake is that it will be the Indian team. Mahesh, I have to ask you first, how did you manage the coup of the century, if I can call it this? Pete Sampras and Roger Federer, uh, you know, you've tantalized tennis fans like never before. I think, uh, you know, it's just a bumper bonus. Uh, personally, as a tennis fan, just being able to bring Roger to India is, uh, you know, something that I'm very proud of. Uh, but having Roger and uh, Pete on the same team, sitting on the bench uh, for the Micromax India Aces is going to be a treat to watch. Yes, uh, Rahul, we couldn't quite uh, see Roger's era coincide with Pete's era that much. We've only seen a few matches between them. They wouldn't be playing against each other, but just having the two together, the legends, especially the legends of Wimbledon on, uh, you know, of grass tennis, uh, it's quite exciting, isn't it? I think this is going to be a special feast for uh, the, you know, all the Indian fans. This is something, as I said, nothing like anything I've seen before. So... Uh, all right, with that, it's a wrap on this edition of Sports Day. Keep watching headlines today.